Here we are in the amazing surroundings of one of the finest football clubs in the world. Now, we're here because LiveView is committed to sports storytelling, and we're about to spend a day with some of the best sports storytellers who are going to explain to us and to share their experiences with our customers. And they're really going to focus in on two things, how they're using technology to shorten their workflows and to add efficiency. In short, how they're going to dial down complexity and produce more content, more fan engagement for less cost, less time, and less money. So that moment of victory would have been, would have meant less had we not given it to our broadcast partners, our syndication partners. Essentially, we are, have quite a free and easy approach for that because the story is incredible. Why wouldn't you want the world to see it? Then, Graham, we start looking ahead because we have a trip to Istanbul for the Champions League final. How on earth did you go about planning for that? So we split the team, we took a fairly sizable group over to Istanbul, um, and the plan was, I must say, and we used LiveU extensively. So Istanbul, everything that came out of Istanbul was all driven by LiveU. We use LiveU for a lot of our live content around match days, so doing our match day live show, which is a digital show on our social media platforms, also for our big screen content within the Arena Bowl as well. So we find LiveView very useful for getting in and around the stadium to go and capture that content. So of course we wanted to come here today and see what's new with LiveView, what's going to come in the future, what the developments are, because it's something worth keeping a close eye on. We've just finished working on the Rugby World Cup in, in France, following those same principles that we've learned, extending that reach outside of the stadium. LiveView, they're Dalbin. We broadcast live British Speedway um, on our own platform. Had one moment where it, it, it failed quite miserably. Um, the broadcast was ruined, it didn't go out. We had unhappy customers. Um, who were all subscribed to our um, our platform, and we switched to LiveView, and it instantly changed what we what we did. It, we, we, we've never had an issue since. It's just worked. Um, is the easier easiest way to do it? Is yeah, it just worked for us and for FIFA. It's a, the real direction and drive is to be able to take take a, a grassroots view of content, video, video football being played globally and that really led on to the technology and what do we have to do. So we're working with technology partners or looking at how to, in the most cost effective way, capture these games and give them visibility. So if you'd like to go on the tour now and you have an A on your match, stay as a match. 